last try. I'm afraid that you are not permitted in the casino tonight. Oh, no, 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 it's not that you haven't got a ticket, which I'm sure you probably haven't. Uh, it's just because you look ghastly and not suitably dressed to come into the casino here tonight. <laughs> yes, I'm sure you've been in here before, but I certainly would not have let the likes of you into this fine establishment here. I'm afraid that uh, you lack that sense of uh, upper classness we look for in... What's that in your hand there? Yes, just... Uh, what do you call this? Do you believe these to be your ticket in the casino here tonight? Some black chips. Do you know how much these are worth? Oh, you, you won these last... You're going to have to hold on for a second. Right. Um, yeah. We've got a life really one here. Yeah. I don't know. Very unsavory. Yeah, absolutely unpleasant to look at. But apparently they've got a lot of chips. They said they want it. I don't think they're rich, no. Uh, I'll, I'll come see you. One second. Right, I have got to speak to one of my colleagues here. So, uh, if you can just take this, if you'd like to take a little look at that, and I'll be right back to you. Psst. Don't you just hate it when you're so talented at winning games, but you feel like your talents are going to waste? It's upsetting to me to see that the council don't seem to fully appreciate your gaming talents. Sounds like you need the MPL app. MPL is a gaming app who would fully appreciate your talents, but most importantly of all, reward you as your gaming success will earn you money. So don't continue to be a pawn of the gym. I mean, pawn of the play to win games, which take years to even get a sense of accomplishment and enjoyment, but instead dive straight into MPL, where you can play over 10 games from bowling to baseball, fruit chop to the all-time classics like solitaire to what I'd consider the most fun hoops, my favorite. So you can get ultimate satisfaction sinking basketballs into hoops. But how does it work? You could simply deposit cash in your MPL wallet through MasterCard, Visa, PayPal, or Apple Pay. Users can choose any game, pay an entry fee in US dollars, and when you win, it's so easy for you and every MPL gamer to transfer your winnings as they can be withdrawn straight to your PayPal or your bank account. It's completely safe and secure. So you've got peace of mind and it's literally that simple. You can even check out their fun tournaments and also take a candace at their head-to-head -head battles where players get matched against other players based on their skill level. Download is free, so why don't you just download it yourself and check out the game on your iOS app store and on the NPL website for Android. There's a $5 sign-up bonus and you can get up to $20 for referrals. Ever since I've known you, you've been searching for a gaming app of significance, of enjoyment, and I'm sure you'll get it. MPL, proud sponsors of your ASMR tingles tonight. We hope you enjoy it. Right. I'll take that from you before you try to steal that too. Uh, so we appear to have identified the issue here. Uh, the fact of the matter is that we don't believe that you are indeed who you say you are and we believe these chips to be counterfeit. I mean, we've got one chip here, okay, one chip, two chips, three chips, four chips, five black poker chips, six chips, seven chips, eight chips, nine chips, and ten chips. Do you know how much that's worth? Play the innocent with me, but we want to. This in your pocket here, you've been counting around 10,000 pounds that you plan to cash in our establishment here tonight. Now, of course, that's no money for our casino in an area like this, that's peanuts. But the fact that someone a little bit like yourself uh, is trying to 
must make their way into the casino. We one is only to assume that you are in fact trying to make money by bringing in counterfeit chips and claiming that you were in it. I mean, I did see someone in here the other day who looked exactly like you, but uh, they were dressed just a little bit better than you were. That's because it was you. <laughs> nice try. No, of course it wasn't you, because I wouldn't forget your face. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a problem here. You claim to be rolling around with a certain amount of money, and I have in fact spoken to my colleagues and uh, some of the owners here at this casino establishment, a fine establishment of casinos. I have been told that you are indeed allowed into the casino here tonight, so me doing my job as a upper class security guard. I mean, we've got a lot of high rollers in here tonight and they don't really want to be mixing in with the likes of you and someone has to decide who could come in, who could not come in. And everyone who looks wealthy, well off, are more than welcome to come into the casino. Anyone who is not so pleasant looking, shall we say? Okay, a little bit unsavory looking, shall we say? Okay, a little bit under par looking, shall we say? Okay, a little bit of the symbol kind. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna let those people in. Though, there would be a little bit of an exception if you were dressed smart, but you couldn't even pass the first hurdle there, could you? No, we have many suit shops here in the area, or oh, the tourist suit shops here, and all the things you could possibly need to smarten yourself up if you were coming to this establishment. Okay, I'm just the first level of security. Yeah, okay, you have to go through me, you have to go through inside security, then you get to meet the black suits, okay, and bow ties, yeah, and they will then give you a good old firm check over, and then after that you may be let into the casino, and I, even then you can't guarantee you will get your entry, so this, in my section, I make sure that this is the most thorough checks, and like I said, Personally, I want to bring you in. You haven't made an effort whatsoever to come into the casino, dress smartly like you're here for a civilized evening of entertainment and relaxation, though you have opted for outstanding achievement in trying to look like a complete outcast to everyone in this area. And of course, to me, that's not acceptable, but for everyone inside, providing that you spend your chips here, you will be allowed in. So let me just count these for you. I have one chip there, okay, a second chip here, we have another chip here, that's three thousand, that's four thousand, then your chips, that's five thousand, five chips there, that's six thousand, six thousand chips there, seven thousand, seven thousand chips there, eight thousand chips worth of chips, and nine thousand, and then we go to ten. So you have your ten thousand chips there, you can go and get them exchanged for, shall we say, table purposes. Okay, may I recommend one of the most guaranteed lucky tables in there tonight, and it's the SNA.P table. Okay, that's uh, highly, highly uh, efficient for people who wanted to make the quick wins, and I think that someone like you can really, really deserve and probably needs something like that. And then may I suggest once you have won, and you've cashed in your chips for the evening, save that money. Don't waste it, you know? Don't waste it whatsoever on drink or whatever you do, you know? And may I suggest that you invest it down in the suit store. That's down the road. You can deal with uh, going to see the tailor there, okay? So let me give those back to you there. Okay, try not to spend it all at once. You take your winnings, take it down to the nearest suit shop and the tailor and let them fit you with the suit, give you a this book, something, I don't know, just to help that general persona that you are trying to offer me here at the moment and bring into our fine establishment casino. Uh, may I suggest, have you ever seen the films Harry Potter? Okay, on platform nine and three quarters. Well, there's two ways to get in this casino. You can go through the entrance there, 
um, or you can run straight ahead through the magic door with this wall here. Now I would opt for number two, the magic door, running at full speed. Uh, would you feel versed in the ways of uh, that franchise and the story there? Yeah, so as fast as you can, straight into that wall. Okay, the faster you go, then the quicker you will get in. And then head to the SNA.P table there, and I'm sure you'll be onto a winning streak within no time. No, you're opting for the door. What a pity. No oh dear. Well, of course, the door would be the second choice for me, for you. Okay, so enjoy your evening's entertainment. I'll be keeping an eye on you, and of course, if you misbehave, I'll be more than happy to personally come in there myself and drag you out as quickly and efficiently as possible and remove you from the premises here, okay? Because nobody really wants to see you around here, okay? It's not that you're not a very nice person. I'm sure you're an absolutely lovely, charming person. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but it's the fact of just you. You know, you just don't look up a class around here, okay? You don't look like you belong in this area so much, okay? So with pleasure, I would love to exclude you from the casino here, but of course, I am able to let you in and go and enjoy yourself, but not too much, okay? Make sure you have some etiquette when you're inside and try and act like a member of society. Yeah, I'm sure that was you in here the other day, yes, and of course you were in a tuxedo. Yes, of course you were, I expect you got that from the tailor around here, not so far from here. Yeah, 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 of course you did. So I'm baffled as to why you're not wearing your tuxedo here tonight then. Stifling story, but I haven't got time to listen to you. So remember, go straight to the SNA.P table and uh, you'll be sure, I'm sure, I know the person there, okay, who works on that table and you'll be in for a guaranteed win. Believe me, I'm sure that you will make all your money back and probably triple that within no time. You're welcome, of course. Okay, well, I wouldn't be doing my job if I wasn't welcoming to all of the potential customers and offering you any forms of assistance that I can give you. Okay. Well, it's my pleasure. Please. But I'm, I'm not interested in what you have to say now. Just go inside. Oh, good evening. And... Um, Oh, please, the inside. Yep, yeah, that's it. Anything I can assist you with? <laughs> Enjoy your evening. Enjoy your evening. Oh, and uh, there's uh, on the house there. You're welcome. The most welcome. This is a new game 
Well, to be honest, we would like to specialize a little bit here at the casino. And uh, we were told that a very special individual would be joining us here at the casino tonight. So we wanted to lay on a fresh table and do a very special once in perhaps a month game for you here tonight. And this is going to be perfect for you. I heard that uh, you wanted to go to the luckiest of tables. So you wanted to spend your chips there. Please do put your chips down. Thank you. And you wanted to win and perhaps leave with more chips tonight. That's perfectly fine. So do you know how much you hope it went tonight? That is indeed quite a lot. Do you believe that luck is with you tonight? Very confident. Though I highly doubt that. Okay, so what I'm going to do is do some mixing of the cards so you make sure that you pay close attention that there isn't anything fixed here whatsoever. Okay, so just keep shuffling these until you are satisfied. Please do let me know when you wish me to stop. So what I could do 
is uh, where my gloves if I'm handling your chips, but I just assume that you are quite sanitary and clean, okay? You could never be too sure with people like you, and I mean no offense with that. I just mean that you probably don't wash or take good care of yourself, okay? Hopefully no offense taken there as well. All right. Please place your chips on the table there. Great. Get those there for you. So what we do here on in, or here on out, is that you just let me know what chips you like, pet, and then I will place them for you. Okay, so how this works, are you familiar with the professional complicated game of it's a different variants of poker and being a professional such as yourself, you probably know all about it, but there's a notorious sort of poker game called Snap. Are you familiar with that? Okay, so you've heard of it, right? So basically the fundamentals of the game is dealer. And as we say individual like yourself, you have to place a bet. Dealer can sometimes chip in and place a bet there as well. And then should two cards correlate with one another through numbers or letters, then of course that is the time you pronounce it and say the word snap. Should you get there first, then you will double the amount that you put in and place your bet. You will get double the amount if you don't put anything in, you of course won't win anything at all. Dealer is able to up the ante and match bets there as well, though if you, it's not yours then of course you personally have to pay up that as well. So I'm hoping that you have a very fair game this evening, I'm sure you will, and you will have a lot of fun and relax in the process there as well. Okay, are you ready? Please just count your chips there for me, let me know how many you've got, pay close attention to your chips and keep looking at your chips. Keep looking at your chips and pay close attention to your chips, okay? Keep counting your chips, keep counting your chips, keep counting your chips. Yep, keep counting your chips and you'll have a great time. Yep, that was fine. Keep counting, keep counting, keep counting, keep counting. So how many do you think we've got there? Perfect. Well, that's quite the amount there. So, like I said, a lot of high rollers in here tonight and they obviously, so we say, spend a little bit more than you. There. I'm sure that's quite a lot there for you. Right, okay, so shall we begin? So I will place the card down like so. Jack, three, and five, and so on, and so on. So that's the just. Okay, please, place your bed. I find it quite humorous that you say a thousand there. You do know that these are in fact 100. I expect the no, security card was just playing a little joke that you appear to have followed it up on, so gladly uh, I found that very humorous. You want to place 200 then, so these are 100, not 1000, okay. 200, bet, okay. So let's just begin. Six. Ace, 
seven, eight, king, nine, ten, seven, five, three, king. Deal up in about in halfway through and ask should you want to add a little bit more for a bit more fun there. We we'll do have a good think about it and uh, hopefully there will be something in there for you. Yeah, so uh, I strongly recommend that perhaps you bet 100 in there as well. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, that that would be great. Okay, 400 bit there. Well done. It's like why your concentration. Okay. You were, you were so close there, unfortunately. You just didn't quite get there, I'm afraid. That's a shame, they were so close. I couldn't believe it. No, I'm, I'm certainly not card counting whatsoever, but... Give that a little bit of a shuffle in there. And we add that to the pack. Right. So, place your bets, please. Brilliant. 
into a, a non smoking environment. This is not a, that sort of casino. Okay, that's what you used to do. Okay, so I really do appreciate you trying to fit in, but maybe just a little bit too much. Okay, but we're allowed because we obviously want you to have a good time and leave happy. Okay, so I think perhaps you would like to up your bet. Are you sure? 500's a lot. Well, yes, I know I've got quite a lot of chips here. These chips, yes, of course. I could easily match that, and should you get the snap, then of course you will leave with another 500 there. Put your chips there for you. Okay, so 500 bid. Right. Ace, six, four. Jack, are you sure about this? You paying attention? Three, eight, three. Shuffle them again here. I think 
like already. Let's pick it. Six, three, queen, seven, king, six, five, nine, four, three, ten, two, snap. Oh, excellent. I mean, that's, I'm so sorry to see it. Really, I'm, I'm terribly sorry to see that. Just haven't got luck on your side tonight. I'm afraid it's just not with you, but it's with me. That's great, excellent. Well, put those there next to mine. Well, I think the only solution he left for you is you to bid your final chip there. Okay, I wouldn't recommend leaving with it as I probably wouldn't get you much here. Okay, so out of pure goodness of the dealer's help, let me just. Off you there, okay. One bit from you, one bit from me. Let's see if we can double that up. You get you back on on target, okay. Okay, nine, seven, ten, jack, queen, snap. Oh, it breaks my heart, it really does break my heart. And I just really hoped that you would win here tonight. There was there was just felt an aura of luck on your side, but unfortunately it just wasn't meant to be tonight, it really, it really wasn't meant to be, and that's just one of those unfortunate things here at the late night casino, but the problem is, it's a relaxing casino, so please don't look too upset, just feel more relaxed, and hopefully it's more about the experience of being here, because it's not often that, shall we say, individuals such as yourself or persons who look like yourself are let into the casino here so really don't feel bad about your misfortunes here tonight just feel good that the dealer here at the casino was able to increase his gathering there now i really thought he was going to do an all-in situation so you know that's what usually happens on poker so I mean, I'd like to replicate all your chips, but unfortunately you don't have any, so it's more something like this. You lay those chips out there. I lay those chips out there. I lay those chips out there. <laughs> those are my new ones. Yeah. Lay those chips out there. Lay those chips out there, and then what I would do is push it all in and say all in. And then whatever's right on the table has to be matched by everyone else. And then be a matter of who wins the jackpot there. And let me just add your ones in there as well. So I'll do something like all in. And look at all those chips. Now, you want this, don't you? But I'm afraid it's not for you tonight. Unfortunately, you didn't do so well here on the SM AP table, that's just the way it goes. I mean, some people, I mean, majority of people tend to go uh, and win plenty on here, but unfortunately, I believe that you just weren't skilled enough on this table. That's just how it goes. And now you have seen to all the chips that you, you said that you won here, you've lost them all at the casino here. That is just terrible, but at least you know that this casino will endeavor to always create a relaxing environment for all the upper class individuals in this area. And as you can look around, I mean, they've probably got horse and cards house out as well. So how were you traveling? <laughs> By foot. No, who did? Who did? Who did? Well, that's such a great shame. Look, I feel a little bit bad for you. Why don't you go get yourself you know, something at the bar? Okay, maybe get yourself something to eat there as well. And uh, maybe next time, might I suggest that instead of uh, wasting all of your winnings at a table, that you probably cash in those and perhaps get yourself a bespoke something and smile yourself up a little bit before you enter the casino here and have a night of entertainment and, of course, relaxation here, yeah, okay, that will enable you to fit in just a little bit better around here, I mean, look at the people, but don't look at people, okay, look at people, don't look at people, okay, don't look at people, okay, there's so many elites here, and uh, who knows exactly what they're doing, and they're rolling with probably more than this, okay, but like I said, this table 
especially set up for you the waveform and all the action there so I really hope that you enjoyed your time here at our casino, RET Casinos. It was a pleasure to play with you here tonight. Thank you for bringing in your chips and uh, deciding to take your chances with us. And it didn't work out for you, which is sad for you, but great for us. So hopefully there's something else that you can do here. Oh no, you could take as much time as you like. Look, this is the kind of casino where we like to look hard at everyone who comes in, right? So one, two, what if I was to give you just a little bit of a parting gift? That's the very least that I can do for you. The very absolute least. I strongly think that you should just take these with you tonight. Okay, look, we're doing very well here. Perhaps you would like to get yourself, I don't know, Perhaps you'd like to get a bespoke something. You know, you probably, I don't know if he's in tonight, but our suit makers around here, and they can fit and create anything. Smarten yourself up, you know, it might fit in a little bit around here, a little bit better. Okay, so if I was to give you these items, then perhaps you might get yourself something. Okay, make yourself fit a little bit. I just feel a little bit bad with your losing losing tonight so out of the goodness of my being here is a gift from our casino here for you tonight so be sure to smart yourself up and come back it's very least I can do so please take your winnings with you no worries don't thank me don't say anything to me I'd rather you didn't say anything at all no it's, it's too much for me to bear so take care of yourself. Cheerio. Yeah, they're on the way out now. Yeah, I've given them some chips and I think that they stole them from the casino. Terrible, isn't it? Thank you.